hugging my tree. It was super, super windy at the beach, and so here I am um, in this lovely little park. But today, my message to you from here in Miami Beach, where my travels have taken me today, is about lists. And I love to keep lists. Now, in the past, they were on paper, and now that I'm traveling, uh, they're electronic. <laughs> because I don't have a desk, I don't have a file cabinet, I don't have any place to keep paper things. I do have a small notebook, but um, in general, I keep most of my lists electronic now. I'm, I'm so surprised to myself. And I can talk more about that later because I have this wonderful tablet called a Remarkable 2, and oh my god, it's so much fun. Anyhow, back to lists. One of my lists that brings me the most pleasure is my list where I, I have things listed that bring me joy, that bring me pleasure. Yeah, I keep a list on that. So um, I've talked about this before, so maybe you, you've heard me speak on this, but um, it's so important to keep track of the things that bring you joy. I'm so surprised that on my list, pretty much most of it doesn't even cost any money. It's, it's, it's things that, that, that bring me joy. Like, oh, you know, swinging in a hammock. Oh, or a swing attached to a very tall tree. Oh, I, I just love that. What's the cost of that? Well, if you're installing your own swing, maybe there's a bit of a cost or buying your own hammock. Um, what else brings me joy? Walking barefoot on the beach. Ah, I love that. Um, I, I do love sitting on a cold winter night in front of a, a for fire, a real fire, a real wood burning fire. We had the best, most gorgeous, huge fireplace in our house in Alaska. Ah, so nurturing. How about um, luxuriating, just cuddling up in a super soft blanket? Ah, so nice. What's the cost of that? Um, reading something that just thrills you, that, that just brings just those thrill bumps to you. It just really moves you. These are things, oh, butterflies. So these are things for me that bring me joy. Just, just looking at fresh flowers growing somewhere, the beautiful vibrancy of them, seeing a sunset or a sunrise. These are the things that bring me joy and I keep a list of them. And I encourage you to do the same because then you can see if you add more of those things into your life and take time for those things and slow down to savor those things, then you add a lot more sweetness and a lot more joy into your life. Sometimes when we are eating and choosing food um, and we desire something sweet, we can really get that from sweet, we can get that sweetness, we can get that sweet feeling from other things, not just food. So think about that. So next time maybe, oh, I, I need a little, something, a little something sweet. Maybe call a best friend. Maybe listen to your favorite music and dance. Maybe um, open up a book that you love and read your favorite passage. Maybe anything that's on your happiness list. Those things that bring you joy. Okay, that's my message for today. I hope you all are having an amazing day. Um, this is our last day here in Miami Beach. So we are, we'll be heading out of our Airbnb here and um, hopping on a cruise in the morning. So um, you'll be seeing me from who knows where, if I even have internet. So we'll see how that goes. But here I am now, Pamela Lapointe, your wildly vibrant, lifestyle holistic coach because you know life is more about everything coming into balance that holistic thing so that's what I'm going towards it's not just about your food choices and it's not just about um, your body and all that it's everything and it's feeling good about that and so that's where I'm taking my practice moving it into a more holistic area and thank you for being along for the journey I hope you have an amazing day Bye for now.